Hello, welcome back to Cooking with the Events. Welcome back to Cooking with the Events by Colette. Today we're going to be cooking something that I was challenged to create. Um, as a mother of a preschooler, we were asked to bring something healthy to share instead of candy at my son's school uh, for Valentine's Day. And I thought, well, you know, you have to deal with allergies, no nuts are allowed due to allergies, what would toddlers like, and also no sugar is uh, allowed at school. So I thought, gosh, what am I going to make? <laughs> um, I based my recipe off of a recipe that I have in my published cookbook, um, my cheesy apple nut clusters. Um, this is uh, Never Go Hungry Again. It is available on my website. Um, but we are going to be making apple cinnamon clusters. Uh, you can add nuts if you like. We're going to be adding nuts today um, just because it is a little bit more filling. But did you know that there are 7,500 types of apples? My goodness, <laughs> I had no idea. Um, fortunately, I do love, my favorite is um, one of the 10 most popular ones available, the Fuji apple that is originally from Ajax. Oh. See, the milky See. Um, apples actually are originally from Central Asia. Um, so Fuji is one of those Asian apples that I love. Well, let's go ahead and get started. Oh, Wait. mama. I'm on. Oh, see los huéspedes. Okay. Risi, dígame. ¿Quién son los huéspedes hoy? Iggy Oogie. Oh, Iggy Oogie. Okay, los huéspedes. Risi, muestra la cámara. Iggy Oogie. <laughs> Gracias, abuela. <laughs> esos, esos, ellos estaban regalos de abuela, papá. Sí, sí. Bueno, okay, Risi, vamos a añadir la harina. Okay, suave. Suave, suave, Grace, suave, gracias, suave, okay, suave, so we're going this muy lento, okay, estoy muy. Uh, so we added uh, gluten-free flour, as you know, all of our recipes are gluten-free, um, just for a little bit more added nutrition, we are adding uh, flaxseed meal, enough, okay, uh, like I always forget to mention at the beginning of the video, I do post the uh, the recipe on our website with the video and on our Instagram and our blog. Uh, so all the measurements are there. I apologize. Cooking with a toddler. Um, it's amazing for their growth, but you have to be very quick. <laughs> okay, Viva. Uh, ¿Y qué es eso? Nueces. So we added... Um, crushed or actually ground up uh, walnuts. I recommend grounding them up in a food processor if possible. Uh, they just cook a little more easier. And as I mentioned before, you don't have to add nuts to this recipe, but I am just for more added protein. Uh, okay, Risi, la canela. And as I mentioned before, these are apple cinnamon. Cuidado, muy bien, muy bien. E, oh, okay. Sal. Okay, suave y lento, 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 muy bien. Okay, y las manzanas. So these are very finely chopped up, just one medium apple of your choice. As I mentioned before, uh, Fuji is my favorite type of apple, so that is what we're going to be using today. And we will go to Snowmo after oh, nap. See, sí. una buena aventura. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, because we do have dairy allergies in our house. Um, I did receive a list of uh, local ice cream places that um, are vegan. And lo and behold, oh, mama. one is about five minutes from us called Snow. And Mama, I'm what? Y podemos invitar um, Evangeline Journey Christa. Uh, 
Um, vamos a ver si sí, es una buena idea. Sí, um, enviamos un mensaje a ellos, ¿ok? Sí. Ok, muy bien. Ok, y polvo de manzana, applesauce. Applesauce. Applesauce is a great ingredient if you're trying to skip out on sugar. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, muy bien. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. Yeah, so if you're trying to cut out sugar, applesauce is a great alternative. Um, it's sweet and it's mushy and it adds moisture. Okay, because we, as we all know, when you bake with sugar, it turns into liquid. <laughs> liquid fat. Okay, a ver, Risi y leche. Risi leche, we're adding uh, milk. Um, as, as you have been following us, as you all know, whenever we cook, we use uh, flaxseed milk, um, good karma flaxseed milk. It is non-dairy. A ver. <laughs> yes, we love milk in this family. Tu te gusta leche mucho. Sí. Uh, we have two teaspoons of melted butter right in here. Yes, don't be afraid of fat. Um, sugar is a thing that you should not eat much of, but fat is actually okay in your diet. Which we are discovering more of today um, versus about 20 years ago. Okay. E. Okay, as I mentioned before, yes, we're not adding sugar, but we are going to add just a little bit of honey. Uh, it just, it needs it. <laughs> I hate to say it. Okay, a ver, poco más. Oh. Last two ingredients, egg and honey. Okay, we see, ¿quieres hacer huevo? Allá. Allá. Boom. Bam. Boom. Okay. <laughs> Bang. Eggy. La yema. Yogurt. Okay, momento. Whoa. Okay, and uh, if Daddy, you don't know this, whatever you Rafferty, do. Rafferty oh. um, can eat um, eggs, no, um, a, um. Un cocinado? Uh, no, me. Si, sí, no cocinado, si. Sí. Um, yes, if you don't already know this, whenever you do cook with eggs, please wash your hands immediately afterwards. Um, anything uncooked eggs on you uh, could cause salmonella. Yes, it's very rare, but just wash your hands. We need to wash our hands more anyways in this world right now with what's going on with the pandemic. A ver. Miel. And the coronavirus. Uh oh. Casi está vacío. And it's slowly coming. Valentine's Day at my son's school. We see, moment, necesitamos pasear primero. The children loved them. The teacher said that they were gobbled up. The children wanted a second one. And I have to say the same. I had one too, and I wanted a second one. <laughs> They're refreshing, yet sweet, Hi, yet not too sweet, and satisfying. Okay. Two pairs. So, any sort of local non-raw honey i recommend uh, we're just gonna combine all the ingredients together Doo -doo -doo -doo. and if you didn't hear that beep in the background before earlier i did preheat the oven at 350. estas disfrutando tu miel reese okay uh-huh okay
Let's see, what else did I forget to tell you about this fun recipe? Oh, how did I forget this? Um, I don't know if you all knew, but apple is considered to be a super fruit. I guess that's why they always say an apple a day keeps a doctor away. Uh, you can eat an if you eat an apple a day, yes, it will keep the doctor away as long as you do eat all the other super fruits too. <laughs> uh, apples don't tend to have um, some of the other things that other super fruits have, uh, like protein and omega threes. But it does help with a lot of other health benefits. Um, such as lowering cholesterol and decreases blood glucose levels, and it's a great source of fiber. So yes, an apple a day does help keep the doctor away. Ah, there. Okay, now we're gonna put these in. Mama, yo quiero más miel en este. No más ahora. So I have a few different uh, muffin tins. I'm just deciding to use my silicone tins today. These were an amazing gift from my mother years ago. And I kind of looked at her funny when she gave them to me and I thought, I'm not gonna use these. I use them all the time now. <laughs> Thank you, mother. Gracias, abuela. Si. Okay. Okay, Racy. Are you mama para llenar? I knew it. Okay, a ver. No hay nada dentro. Pero hay miel dentro. No, it's mantequilla. So even though these are silicone uh, little cups, I do always spray them. Um, anything that's nonstick, I always just spray them because they just they don't work perfectly. Things still stick. No, uh, no, no, no. Tú necesitas esperar. Reese is very anxious to eat these because yes, they are very good. Uh, Reese, necesitamos esperar. No, no. Reese, recuerda this. Hay huevos. Hay un huevo. No cocinado adentro. Recuerda this? Yes, please don't eat any raw eggs, especially when you're under the age of five. Uh, we have been making sushi lately for Reese, so he can try it um, because going out to restaurants right now is not the most recommended thing with the pandemic um, but we have been making sushi with cooked fish and he loves it so if you haven't made cooked fish salmon for your toddler recommend it we see sushi see what case is this kind of the on top is that to me now oh okay see I say mucho calor it is very hot here in Austin, Texas right now. Uh, we are in the middle of summer. And it's just about to get hotter in a few weeks in August. August is our hottest month of the year. And we did have plans to escape it this year, but of course we were hit with this lovely virus. Oh, wow. Um, traveling is not something that is advisable right now. We actually got uninvited for my parents to come. <laughs> what parents uninvite their daughter? Well, I get it. Sorry, Dad. <laughs> okay, Racy. Casi estamos terminando. We're gonna fill these about three fourths full um, because they is gluten free. They won't rise too much. Um, there's no yeast. There's no baking powder. There's no baking soda. Um, so fill them up about three fourths full or just even almost all the way full if you have the batter for it. Um, and then we are going to cook these oh, 30 minutes and let them cool for all the proteins to stick to each other and voila, you can enjoy them for a snack, breakfast, dessert. If you want to have them for lunch, by all means, do that. Okay, we're gonna put these in the oven for 30 minutes and then we will let them cool and enjoy. Okay. Hello, so we 
went ahead and took out the clusters from the oven and while we were waiting for 30 minutes we actually started a puzzle of the asap. See, it's 100 pedacitos, 100 pieces. Wow. Gracias, abuela. Um, went ahead and just... Okay, momento, okay? Terminamos el video. Uh, went ahead and just showcased the main ingredients, the uh, flavors. Canela, cinnamon, nueces, walnuts, and flour. Awesome. Uh, we're just gonna let them cool for a little bit more and go ahead and enjoy them again for any meal of the day that you'd like. They're actually very healthy for you. Have a good day. Thanks for joining us. Ciao. Bye. Ciao. Mm-hmm. <laughs>